Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will try to learn about special relays for timing control in FATEC PLC. But before start this video, please like, share and subscribe my channel. This way you will be never miss my upcoming videos. So let's get started. First of all, I will introduce you this is the manual of our FATEC PLC. There is he saying pulse signals in Chapter number 3, he says M1920 is a 0.01 second clock pulse, one available and also one more M1921 is a 0.1 second clock pulse and M1922 is a one second clock pulse and M 1923 is a 60 second clock pulse and how we can use in this relays I will show you in the program first of all here we will take one M1922 for example this is one second single clock pulse and we will use one output relay for example Y0 or Y1 any we can choose and I will give in run condition and you can see this is any we not giving signal or something this is directly internally bullet in the PLC this is giving after one second one plus pulse giving and our you can use out output relay y1 y0 or y2 3 and you can choose and this will be giving pulse and it will be continuously running and this system you can be used for blinking LEDs or something any or where is your logic designs after like to be make some long value timer if you like to be make can also you can use this is very helpful command uh, helpful relay and this is the internally how can you use this for for example long value timer if you like to make how we can make let's see stop the PLC and simply this pulse which is coming at Y1 this pulse you can use for increment command because of this is directly cannot use you have to be design the logic first you have to design the logic use the output input signal of the Y1 and mix the increment and this also you can use this one as a rising edge TU contact this contact is for giving any single pulse also giving and also here you can make it for increment and you go to the function and use it here INC command INC command and here you can give the name for example D0 if you choose for example this is pulse is coming and after what we do one make we will make one relay for example M0 for example we will make here or M1 any you can choose M200 for example make M200 if we choose for comparison go to the function and write here cmp directly and comparison command you will got and here you can write the value of which you data register use d0 you use and make comparison with for example this is the single clock pulse and you can use for the 60 seconds for example 60 seconds after one minute yani if one minute timer if you like to make this one you have to be write it here 60 or otherwise if you like to be directly write it in the uh, right from the HMI this here you can use also a data register this is the D0 and we can use it here D10 for example D10 is your time value which you like to be make or convert in the PLC and here in output you can use the relay for example this is M200 you can choose 
m100 for example I'm sorry this is the fonts have problem m200 for example here we can choose this is m200 and here also you can choose m200 and this program download to the PLC also this can use by a C now this d0 we have to be first clear for example make the status page and make it small here d0 is our here put it 0 for example ok now you can see it's counting single single pulse it will count one second after which pulse is coming he stored this value and this value is coming here as this value compares with the compares with this d10 also we have to be give value for example this d10 d10 when gives the value for example 60 we will give we need a one minute one minute timer and we say one minute after our output needs to be on and this also we have to be choose this close contact i think so and make it ok control w dex and see now then as our 60 seconds will be complete after one minute will be complete and after one minute after our after m200 will be energized see our 60 seconds after m200 is our on so i hope friends you will be understand about this relay m900 1922 this is for one second if you like to make an other timer oh i know this is going if you like to use m921 this is 0 0.1 second clock pulse and this is 0 0.01 second and this is the one second if you use for 60 seconds this is m 1923 you can use this is after directly after one 60 seconds after this will be on and off on and off so i hope this is the very simple way to the use of uh, use of this timer anything you can make blinker or long value timer if you like to be make and simply this value you can take the d10 you can take to the hmi and inshallah will be next le next lecture this all my lectures are serious wise serial wise if you see this is all lectures if you like to see this comparison commands how we can use so go to my compare command lectures this you can see how use the compare commands this all lectures if you see 100 percent current you will be complete programming you can learn i hope you understand about this command if not understand anything you can send me message in comment section i will give you feedback as soon as possible so thanks for watching allah hafiz